Hey everybody, welcome to the shelter walk. Just wanted to remind you, you still have a couple days to take advantage of the raffle baskets. Look at these awesome raffle baskets. You can buy these tickets online. They also have a 50-50 raffle, but you literally have to come down to the shelter to participate in that because it is cash. So I can't take a credit card for that, but these you can purchase online. Look at these. Go to CuyahogaDogs.com, look for the raffle link, and all of these beautiful baskets are explained there. And you can buy 12 tickets for $10 or 35 tickets for $25. These are great baskets. All right, let's go in and meet some dogs. Happy Friday. It is Friday, December 17th. 2021 a week before christmas eve also don't forget about this it's just a holly pay fundraiser just donate one hour of your pay one hour and that's the breakdown of what your one hour could buy for these great dogs all right as i said it's friday december 17th I am at the Cuyahoga County Animal Shelter, and this is the Friday Shelter Walk at the Cuyahoga County Animal Shelter. And I have a bag of treats. I do. Hi, buddy. Is this um, Benji? Benji, yeah. Kind of cracked me up his name. I expected you to be little. I did, but you're a big boy. He is sweet in playgroup, I'll tell you that. Sweet dog. All right, we'll pick him up on the other way and have a nice walk. One of our awesome volunteers taking a dog out for a walk. All right, I don't know if I said it, but this is the Friday shelter walk at the Cuyahoga County Animal Shelter. This is Benji's cage. We'll come back and get him, but he's in cage one and you've already met him. Just for fun, I'm gonna leave him a couple treats on his bed. He is a sweet dog. I did have him in playgroup today, and he was wonderful with, uh, with the dogs. A little shy, but uh, he'll come out of his shell. This is Raja. We have had Raja since April. Hi, sugar. Who is my Raja girl? She is feeling a little sad right now. Not because she's been here since April, but because she just got her last heartworm injection. So she can't go on any long, long walks and she can't come to play group because she is on kennel rest right now. We do take her for potty breaks and um, it'll go that way for a month until they retest her to make sure all the worms are gone. And then you're going to be all clear and healthy, right? She's been here since April because she had to have two leg surgeries. And she had to have her tail amputated. So it's been a, a long road for this little sweetie. But she is all healed up now. She had her third injection, so that's all done. The last injection for heartworm. She is ready for a forever home. She could finish recuperating in your home if this girl was a good fit for you. Eight months is a long time to be in a shelter, and she deserves a beautiful, beautiful home. We love her, love her, love her. We call her Raja. She's a boxer mix, and she's three and a half years old. Birthday cake. Hi, buddy. Hi, birthday cake. He's another timid little guy. Look at that pretty face, honey. Can you come this way? I have him this way. It's hard to see you from that far. There we go. Birthday cake. Came in at the beginning of... November. Oh my goodness, you've been here six weeks. You have to like, I don't know, wag your tail more or something. You seem so sad. He is so sweet. But you can see he's a tad bit timid. A little bit reserved when people come by his cage. But he's a beautiful, beautiful dog. We call him birthday cake. He is in kennel four. Hops! Retriever, Terrier, Mix, Female. <laughs> Hi, baby. Two and a half years old. Hi, Dolly. She always cracks me up because she likes to watch that treat go into her mouth. Watch. She will cross her eyes. 
Yes, you definitely do cross your eyes, don't you? Oh my golly, she's so cute. Hops is in kennel five. She's available for adoption now. Digby. Digby is four and a half year old American Bulldog. Look at this beautiful guy. You are beautiful, Digby. He is um, one of our volunteers, literally his best friend. He is so excited to see Frank when Frank comes in and just is as sweet as the day is long. Is, oh, I know you want this treat so much. Nigby is in kennel seven and he is available for adoption now. Let's go, honey. Donnie, hi, Donnie boy. Two year old. Pity Bix. Kennel eight. I should. Another sweetie pie. He does come to play group. He's very powerful. Very strong, very powerful. But what a face on him. What a nice boy he is. We call him Donnie. He's in Kennel 8. We got a lot of dogs, so I'm kind of going a little fast today. This is Frost. Frosty. Hi, big baby. He's one year old. This guy is so excited about life, let me tell you. He's excited about everything. He is the happiest dog you'll ever meet. Come on down. He's beautiful. His coloring is gorgeous. He's so friendly. We call him Frost. And Frost is in kennel nine. And ten. He's got a double cage. All right, heading down here to this little peanut who already has two families in line to adopt. This is Duchess. She's a female. Border Collie mix. Uh, they don't have her as a mix. They have her as a Border Collie. Yeah, I see that. You're about five months old, huh? Now this little girl, wow, in playgroup, holy macaroni. Lots of energy. You got a lot of energy. No wonder you were a little sleepy, huh? You played so hard today. Just a pup, but she does have two families in line. This girl's stray hold. Put my treats away there. Ends on the 19th. And as soon as that stray hold ends, she will be out of here because she does have two names. Barrett. What does that mean, first of all? Let me back up. When we have a dog on stray hold, even if they're on stray hold and you come in to meet them and you fall in love, it's a good match, you can put your name on them. And then if their owner doesn't come in to collect them, they go to the first person on the list. If that person doesn't show up, they go to the second person on the list. Very rarely does the second person not show up. But if it does happen, then they go up for adoption to the public. So um, that's how it works. If a dog comes in and has no identification, like that little girl, no microchip, no tag, they have a three-day stray hold. If they have a microchip or a tag, it's a two-week stray hold. So please make sure your dog has ID. This is Barrett. Barrett has a story. He came in with a bad, bad injury bad injury. Somebody has done something horrible to him. He's been here since October. He's all healed up now. It took a lot to get him well, but his back is fine. It didn't injure the spinal cord. He comes to play group. He's a sweetheart. He's beautiful. You can see that. He runs, he plays, he walks. He's perfect. He's a perfect dog. He's a nice gentleman. He knows some commands. He's three years old. And Barrett lives in kennel 13. Ivy, Ivy, somebody fed you too much chicken and it wasn't me. Ivy, honey, honey. Well, we got to clean up this cage. Here's our little Ivy girl. They got your cage all cleaned up. Does that feel better? I'm only going to give you one little tiny treat, okay? Something made your tummy not feel good. This is Ivy. She's a Boxer Shepherd mix. 
She's two and a half. Here we go. Can we try that? I'm going to leave it here, okay? Just going to leave that there. She's a sweet little girl. What a sweet, sweet girl. And her trail ends on the 19th, so that would be Sunday. And she will be available to go home to a forever family. Good girl, Ivy. Pandora. Oh, look at you. Pandora, little English bulldog. One year old. Hi. Look at your beautifulness. You're adorable. Oh, not an, it says here, French Bulldog, English Bulldog mix. Now that does make sense. Real tiny little pooch. You only come up to the second bar. Yeah. Wow, you're itty bitty. We call this little girl Pandora. They have her at one year old. She's in kennel 15. Goosey. Who's a goosebumps? Hi, Goosebumps. Hi. Who's that handsome guy? Yes, I know. You're always so excited to see anybody. Oh, my gosh. He is just lovely. We love this guy. Come here, Goosebumps. We call him Goosebumps. He's in kennel 16. He's three years old, and he's ready for adoption now. You are so handsome, too, and so smart. Oh, you don't have to lay down. You don't have to lay down. Get up. Nope. Yes, that's a good sitter. You're sitting. Now you're laying down. He's like, which trick do you want me to do for that treat? Here we go, Goosebumps. He is so cute. He's in kennel 16. Let's head over to row two. Oh, here's one of my other buddies. This is Bull. And he's a big boy. He's a Connie Corso mix. He came in. So thin we couldn't put him on the floor. He came in in October. But you can see he's still quite thin, but he's filling out. He's beautiful. He came to playgroup today with two little itty bitty dogs. Here's Sugar. And he did great. He always does. He's a sweet, sweet dog. Loves people, does well with other dogs. He thinks he's a lap dog, seriously. We call him Bull. If you're interested in his age, I don't think he's very old. I think he's around four. But you can find out more about him at CuyahogaDogs.com. And he's in Kennel 17. Hi, Dixie. Who's that Dixie girl? Little female pity, five years old. And she is so pretty. You're a pretty pity. Yeah, you are. You are, too. Sweet little girl, gorgeous color, this gorgeous gray color. You're such a pretty girl, yes, and look at that beautiful nose of yours. You're adorable. Yes, you are so beautiful. Happy tail all the time. Dixie is in kennel 18. Suki. Suki's a very energetic girl, one year old. She's also been here since October. Suki's buddies got adopted and you got left behind, huh? Yeah, they're out of here. She's a sweetheart. Like I said, very energetic. She would definitely benefit from a fenced-in yard. I think you would. Yes, you would. They have her as a hound terrier mix. As I said, she's a year old. There you go, honey. And she's in kennel 20. Down here to Roisin. She is an American Pitbull mix. Hi, doll. I ha oh, you're going to go on your bed now. You always do that. Come on, get over here, silly Roisin. Here's silly Roisin. Oh, no, I know you're going to try to sneak out of here, right? Uh-uh. You got to go back in. I'm trying to give you some treats, honey bunny. Here. How about that? She's always smiling, this girl. Did you even chew it? Did you even bother to chew it? Did you? Did you? One more. Here, doll. She really wants to go for a walk. And the walkers are here, and she will get her walk. Roisin, they don't have an age on her cage. 
but she is available now. She's in kennel 23. I see you, sugar. Make sure that's closed. Butch! Where's my butch buddy? My big butchy boy. Hi, bud. Another dog. Long timer. He's been here since August, which we don't understand because honestly, us volunteers love this dog. He is like a person. I mean, he's smart. He comes to play group with females and males, less dominant males. He's a great dog. He's so much fun. He's so playful. And he's four years old. And he's going to make somebody a great pet. If you like smart dogs who love to go on walks, love car rides, fabulous with kids. One of the volunteers told me that she um, took him on a walk. She took him home for the day. Took him on a walk and he never even gave the neighborhood cats a second glance. He just walked right by him. So that's Butch. He's a great dog. He's in kennel 24. Diva. Good name for you. Diva. Bulldog Mix. Almost four years old. Now they must know who her owner is. Because her stray hold does not end until the 30th of December. So, if you think you know this dog's owner, tell them to come on down and get their dog. She's in pretty good shape. Looks like you've had some puppies. And yeah, you can definitely see English Bulldog in her. Who knows what the other mix is? We don't know. But uh, she's in kennel 25. We call her Diva. Down here to Primrose, who just arrived today about an hour ago and her trail does not end until the 21st you're awful cute you're a little tiny low rider yeah you're just a little short english bulldog aren't you are these treats doing it for you sugar i think they are so they named her primrose because we don't know what her name is she had no identification on her and no chip dogs numbers here. We call them names. And this is Primrose. What a cutie. Kennel 27. She's five years old. Sheldon. Hi, Sheldon. Were you making so much noise? Sheldon is a shepherd mix. He is another playgroup player. We keep him in smaller groups. He's a big, powerful boy. Definitely has that German shepherd size. He's lovely, lovely with people. He's a nice walker. He's a good boy. Aren't you just the best boy? We named him Sheldon, Sheldon, and he's available for adoption now. He's in Kennel 29. Cookie, cookie, cookie. You've been adopted. Congratulations, baby. Dasher. You knew we had to get one of the Santa's reindeers in here, right? This is Dasher. He is a Labrador Retriever mix. And man, is he beautiful. Wow. I don't know if my camera is doing him justice. I'm sure that it's not. His fur looks like velvet. He is stunning. Stunning. But you got a booger in your eye. We got to get that booger cleaned out of there. His stray hold ended today. So another dog, a gorgeous dog, that came in with no ID. Please, please make sure your dogs have identification on them. You are beautiful, Dasher. If you're interested in how old this guy is, check him out at www.cuyahogadogs.com. Let's head over to row three. Now I'm in row three, and this is a new dog. I just put the cage card on her cage. We're calling her Padme. She's two years old, and again, we pulled her from another shelter. That's what that yellow tag is. Unfortunately, her family never put a tag on her, and no microchip. So if you think you know this dog, man, is she pretty. Woo! You are beautiful. She is the most beautiful chocolate brown. I'm sure that she's getting that color from the lab in her. They have her as a lab shepherd mix. 
She is that gorgeous chocolate brown. Wow, she's pretty. Um, anyway, if you think you know her or you think you know her owner, please let her owner know that she's here at the Cuyahoga County Animal Shelter. She's in decent shape. We would like to get all these dogs that don't have tags home to their owners. But if she doesn't go home to her owner, she will be available for adoption in three days on the 21st of December. We call her Podme, Kennel 32, Q, Q, baby, baby, hi. This little boxer mix boy is awesome. He comes to play group. The volunteers adore him. He's smart, he's beautiful, he's fun. He's not a crazy, over-the-top, rough and rowdy. He's nice and mellow. He's a great boy. We call him Q Kennel 33. Check out his age on the website. But, oh, one of my sweeties right here, Jaya. She's four years old. She's been here a little over a month. She came in so timid. She would hide in the corner, afraid of life. Afraid when she came in, afraid anybody would come to take her for a walk, afraid of playgroup. She was afraid. Let me tell you what. After a month here, she has found her confidence. She's not fearful. She's so funny. She does silly things. If you watch the playgroup video today, she was adorable. She got a hold of one of my gloves, and it was so cute. She loves toys. She's a snuggle bug, if there ever was one. She is, you can see, a little bit thin, right? I don't know if you can see from the side. You can see her ribs a little bit, but she has gained a lot of weight. She's so healthy now, and she's ready for her forever home. We named her Jaya, and she's in kennel 36 and 37. Magic, Magic Jack. A little boy, one-year-old retriever mix, and you are so beautiful, Jack. Actually, I call him Magic Jack, but on his kennel it says magic, right? And you were my playgroup buddy today. You were so good in playgroup. He's great with other dogs. This guy is so mellow, just beautiful. You can see how gently he takes treats. He is a precious, precious dog. Just adore him. He's going to make somebody an awesome, awesome pet. He is in kennel 38, and he's ready for adoption now. Emma, are you laying there wagging your tail? Oh, my gosh, we worked this girl so hard today in playgroup. Look at how tired she is. We had her out there for about three hours. She was, oh, my gosh, you really are tired. She greeted all the new dogs to playgroup today. She is so well-rounded. She is great with rough and rowdies. She can adjust her play style for the gentle dainties. She's happy, happy, happy all the time. This girl is so steady, so steady. You know, when we have a dog like this that we use for playgroup, who we just trust so much with other dogs, we love having her here. We need dogs like that to welcome the new dogs, right? But honestly, we would love to see her get into a good home even more. We would keep you forever. Yeah, because that's how good you are, but you deserve a good home. We call her Emma. She's a bulldog terrier mix. She's three and a half years old. She's in kennel 39. Stoney. Now we know who Stoney's owner is, too. Because this dog's trail doesn't end until the 4th of January. You're a new arrival, aren't you? You get a two-week stray hold. Baby, baby, I hope your owner comes to get you. Two weeks is a long time, Stoney. They have him as an American pit bull mix. He's four years old. He's in great condition. You even have a beautiful collar on. But nobody bothered to put identification on you. What the hey, baby? What the hey? Sweet dog, Stoney. Lives in kennel 40. Tavish! Tavish! Hey! Another American pit bull. No age on the cage, but you know you can find his age. And more information on him on the website. Hi, Tavi. 
What a cutie. Now he came in another one. Very, very thin. But you're fat enough to put on the floor now. And we want you to get a good one too. You've got some amazing ears. Amazing ears. Look at those ears. We call him Tavish. And he's in kennel 41. Ocean has been adopted. Yay. I'm so happy for you. I love this dog. But he's out of here. Congratulations, you handsome hunk of man, you. Mr. Moon and Akita. This guy came in about three weeks ago. He's an Akita. He's two and a half. He's a beauty. Man, I wish I had a little bit better lighting in here for him. Come on, Mr. Moon. Look at you. Good boy. He knows some commands. There you go. Take it. You can take it. Here you go. Just take it. Take it. No? Okay, I'll drop it. I'll drop it. You don't want to take it from my hand? It's okay. I'll just put it on the floor. Is that better? How about that? He's like, no, I really want to go for a walk. The walkers are coming, sweetie. They're right behind me. Kennel 43. Noel. Wow, this girl, I just met her for the first time today. Came to play group. She is such a mama dog. You are such a mama dog. Yes, you are. We had her out in play group for a long time. We had a lot of young dogs out there today, a lot of puppies. I'm talking dogs six months, around five, six months old. Man, I'm telling you, this girl, and you can tell that she's had puppies. She is a really good mama dog. Look how happy she is. Look at that tail going. What a sweet, sweet girl she is. We had her in with the social dainties. She did an awesome job rounding up those puppies and keeping them in line, huh? You did everything a mama dog is supposed to do. You're a good girl. We call her Noelle. She's in kennel 44. She's four and a half years old. Hubert! Hi, handsome man. Another four and a half year old dog, and he is fantastic. Who's that good Hubert boy, huh? You are a good boy. Yes, you are. Again, I had him in play group with a couple of other small dogs. He is a gentleman. This guy is a gentleman. Very smart dog. Loves people. He's big, but he's wonderful. If you like big dogs, he is a wonderful, wonderful dog. His name is Hubert. Kill a 45. Bowie! Hi, big Bowie. Thank you. This is an Australian hound dog shepherd mix. He's one and a half, and he has over-the-top energy. Oh, my golly, you're so cute. You act like you're six months old, though. Look how gentle he is, though, in the cage and with people. We brought him to playgroup. Wow, he had a blast, a blast. Right here, Bowie. What a beauty he is. He is so pretty. And I'm telling you, he's barely, barely touching that tree. Some dogs are just so unbelievably gentle. Bowie is one of them. He's so cute. Kennel 46. Mabel! Hey! Hi, pretty girl. Seven years old. Jack Russell. Terrier mix. Now, she's quite tall for a Jack Russell mix because she has her height from being a retriever. Jack Russell Terrier mixed with Retriever. Very energetic player. She is considered a senior dog, but don't tell her that because she does not know that she's a senior. You don't act like a senior. You play like a crazy puppy. She is really a sweetie pie, loves the people, has a few friends that she likes to play with. We don't bring her in with everybody. She's a little bit selective about her friends, but she does have friends. She just doesn't want other dumb dogs in her face, huh? Say, none of those puppies in my face. We call her Mabel, and she's in kennel 47. Let's head over to row four. One more, Mabel. One more. How about that? All right.
right, here we are on row four. I'm in front of Herman's cage. Herman is only a year old. He is a spaniel hound mix. We have some guys doing some work in here, but he's more interested in my treat than he is in those workers, aren't you, buddy? He's so cute. Now, in playgroup, he is a rough and rowdy maniac player. He is so much fun to watch. One end of the yard to the other. In fact, when we bring him in, we just open up the entire yard because he has a lot of energy. But when he's in his cage, he's a gentleman. And he does know his commands. He'll sit for treats. He's a decent walker. And he's still a puppy. He's only a year old. He is a beautiful dog. He's been here a couple of months already, and it's time for him to get a forever home. We gotta get you out of here. Yeah, they're so busy over there, aren't they, Herman? Beautiful dog. He is in kennel 48. Hey, Glory! Little Glory, I love your name. She just came off a straight hold yesterday. Oh, today. Today's the, tw the 17. She is a retriever. Bulldog mix, and you're just as cute as the day is long. We had her in in play group today with uh, rough and rowdies and social dogs. So definitely maybe a little too much energy for an extreme gentle dainty. But she fit into both groups well. She's very social. She gets along with everybody. She adores people. Adores people. I mean, like clingy. Very clingy to people. You love the people, don't you? She's not very big. And she is only about seven months old, so she's still a puppy. Yes, and you're a good puppy, aren't you, Glory? We call her Glory. She is in kennel 49. Okay, this is Charm. She is a bully boxer mix. She is another one of our go-to girls. Super social girl. When we have a dog in there that is not really great about dogging yet because they've never been in a play group, she makes appropriate corrections. So she's not ridiculous, but she lets them know when they're doing something that she doesn't like without tipping. She's a great little dog. She's not very big. You can see that she's just not big at all. You're just a little tiny pocket girl, huh? She loves people. She's great with almost all dogs. I've never been afraid to put her with a dog, ever. She's a good girl. We call her Charm. I really don't understand why she's not out. She's so cute. She's well behaved. She's a great dog, and man, doesn't she love those treats? You're drooly. You're a little bit drooly right now. Okay, that's Charm, kennel 51. I see you, potato. Hi, Miss Potato. You were in the play group with Charm today, weren't you? Potato was only a year and a half old. She's a terrier shepherd mix. Now, she is one noisy player. This girl, when she plays, oh my gosh. There is so much noise that comes out of her. Growling, barking, over the top, but it's all in good fun. Some dogs are just very vocal players and Potato fits that bill for sure. You can see she's quite enthusiastic about everything. Especially treats. She's in kennel 52, come on down. There you go, Potato. And she's in 53 as well, she's got a double cage. Muscles, how you feeling, buddy? He couldn't come to play group last week because he had a cold. He's a seven-year-old big guy. He is a terrier bulldog mix. Look at the size of you. You're amazing, and you love food, don't you? Yes, you do. So because he had a little cold, you can see he's on a harness, right? Because when we walk him, we don't want anything pressing on his um, throat. It makes him cough. Once he gets past the cold, you will be just fine. You will be just... Oh, wow. Look at that big old nose of yours. He's a beauty. He's a nice dog, too. Really nice. Muscles is in kennel 54. Opal. Pretty Opal girl. Three years old, people. She's been here a while. She is a sweet dog. You're another one. Now, she's a rough and rowdy player. 
She looks all prim and proper in her cage. When you get her out in the play yard, she is definitely a rough and rowdy player. But she knows how to be a lady in a home and in a cage, right? Say, I'm a lady, people. Don't let my play style fool you. We call her Opal, and she is in kennel 55. Uh, one of my new favorites right here, this is Metro. Nice dog. He is 100% gentle and dainty. We don't put him with rough and rowdies. I mean, we keep him with the most gentle and dainty of the gentle and dainties. This guy is all couch potato. The gentle and dainties we put him in with are ancient. Or they're recuperating in medical. I mean, he's really that gentle and dainty. We call him Metro. He is so sweet. Such a sweet dog and he's so beautiful. His coloring is gorgeous. And Metro lives in Kennel 56. One more? Okay. I got one more for you. How about it? Right, there you go. Over here to Mimosa. I like Mimosas. I do. I like you a lot. You're awful cute. Look at this beautiful Siberian Husky. She's four and a half years old. And her stray hold ends on the 19th of this month. So it was a short one. We brought her in with the social group today. She's not a rough and rowdy, but she's not an over-the-top gentle and dainty either. She's somewhere in between. She loved, loved, loved playing with the puppies. Seriously, I was really surprised because, you know, some huskies can be a little bit crabby. Not this girl. She had a ball, a ball. She acts like she's a year old. She was having so much fun out there. So uh, come on in and meet this beauty. She is fantastic. We call her Mimosa. And she is in kennel 57. Hi, Buttercup. Hi, Buttercup. Who's that pretty girl? Shepherd Nook, she's two and a half years old. Her stray hold ends on the 19th. Now it looks like you might be in heat. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing in there, huh? This little girl is in heat right now. Uh, of course, you know that all of our dogs get spayed or neutered before they leave the shelter. So I don't know if they can do that while they're in heat, so we'll have to wait till the heat ends. But uh, before she leaves here, she will be spayed as are all of the females and all of the boys are neutered. We call this little girl Buttercup. Her stray old ends on Sunday. She's in kennel 58. Gemini. Hi, baby. Hi, Gemini. Little tiny girl, one year old. I don't know what happened with your teeth. I don't think that we can get you braces, though. She's got some pretty janky teeth. I know that. But she is really a dolly. She is a, a social, gentle, and dainty. Not a rough and rowdy. Say, I'm much too timid to be a rough and rowdy. We know that about you, sweetness. She's a dolly baby, just a dolly baby. And she is in kennel 59. One more, honey. There you go. Over here to this new guy, Crocodile. He came in a couple days ago. He's a shepherd mountain cur mix. So you know he's pretty big, right? And I don't believe he's ever missed a meal. Now he is uh, a little hacky. For some reason he was coughing a little bit, although he seems fine now. But that's why he's got the, the harness on. They don't want anything pushing on his throat right now when he gets a walk. They call him Crocodile. He's lovely. And he will be ready for adoption at the end of the day tomorrow. I believe they told me he's seven years old. But don't quote me on that. Look it up on the website at www.cuyahogadogs.com. He's in Kennel 60. Hi, Brandy. Hi, little Brandy. This dog is wacko. <laughs> She's six months old, and man, she's got the energy 
of a six month old. I'm wondering if you don't have some Jack Russell Terrier in you. Because you are so energetic. We do bring her to playgroup. She is so funny to watch. She's a little tiny thing, you can see that. Like I said, only six months old. She's precious. And she's in kennels, 61. She is available for adoption now. And you, girly, look at you. Did any of you watch the video last week? This is the dog that was hiding back there by that blue ball. And I got her halfway to come to the front of the kennel, but I couldn't get her to come all the way. She was so scared last week. Look at her this week. You're fabulous. You are fabulous. Yes, you are. We call her early. She's two years old. And she is a darling. Just a darling. A little girl. And she's ready for adoption now. Oh, good job. I'm going to give you some of these, too, because now I'm out of treats. Yeah, you love that food, don't you, early? Oh, she's a good girl. I wanted to get Benji in again. You met him at the beginning of this video. There he is in his cage. Beautiful, wonderful dog. There you go. There you go. He has a double cage. He loves playing with his ball over there. Yeah, that made a big difference, huh? You were a little bit lonely and bored in here, but you're feeling better now. He's in kennels one and two. So when we went down road two before, Tesla was out on a walk. She's an Australian cattle dog terrier mix, and she's wonderful. She's been with us a while. She's eight years old, but she does not know that. She thinks she's much younger. She comes to playgroup and hangs out with the young pups. She is as sweet as the day is long. She's so gentle and dainty. We adore this girl. And she's also the Cuyahoga County Animal Shelter's daily dog on Facebook. So they dress her up every day and take fun pictures of her and she's just preciousness overload. Tesla lives in kennel eight, or 28, sorry. All right, everybody, that's who we have for you this week. And you know that Dogs are coming in probably right now as I'm closing up this video. Please, if you're thinking of adding a new furry family member to your household, adopt. Don't shop. These dogs all belong to someone once. Every single dog in this shelter belonged to someone once. They've all been failed by whoever that person was. Please. Adopt. Give a dog a chance. These are wonderful dogs. They all belong in a good home. You all belong in a good home, don't you, Dolly? All right. Have a happy week. I hope your Christmasing is going beautifully. And we'll see you next week.